Alright folks, welcome back to Let's Play Romance of the Three Kingdoms. This is Mysterious JG. Uh, we are attacking uh, Li Zhang's forces. Uh, didn't have much difficulty taking his first three cities, but he's got two left and they're very remote. And have more trouble getting to them than fighting Li Zhang's forces there. We also got some dudes being led by the sniveling and treacherous Yang Song, who uh, basically caused the downfall of Zhang Lu in the novel. He worked for Zhang Lu, but he like took bribes and, you know, said bad things about good officers, basically screwed everything up. But he is now being entrusted with just carrying shit back and forth. He's going to bring a bunch of weapons to Ling, which we will use to conquer Cheng Sha. Once we've conquered Cheng Sha, then we can deal with... Uh, We can do with Zhao Fan at our leisure. Zhao Fan currently employing both uh, Branded Elementa and uh, Shi Grimoth. Which is, you know, other than, other than the fact that they're two cities that we can put in a district together and I don't have to govern them because there won't be anybody who can attack them uh, if their order stays high enough that they don't get barbarian problems, then yeah, that's the big reason I want them is to get those created officers. Now, you guys already have your marching order, so there's not a whole lot that I need to do with you. So let's, um... Uh, keep spinning them action points here. Our new officer needs to be rewarded. Send people to employ some of these guys. It's hard for me to remember. Sent a bunch of guys to employ Sin Cheng Jing, and that was a complete waste. But eh, what you gonna do, you know? Zhu <coughs> Gang Liang is running this city. He was the one who was busy before and didn't get to leave. Now I got Zhu Ge Liang in this city by himself. Well, he's got a bunch of generic officers with him, but nobody I care about. Why don't I take charge of these orders? Well, because I really don't want you to still be in this stupid city, actually. Oh, good grief. Diplomacy. Can you, Zhu Ge Liang, get you, Liu Zhang to surrender? No, you can't. Well, while you're here, let's get you to employ that guy you said you can employ. Security off, oh, fuck you, Yan Yan. Ooh, Duke Cow Cow. Promotion for Cow Cow because he got back his city. Yan Yan escaped. I should have taken the gold for him. Yuna is apparently advancing on our Chengdu. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Liu Zhang has decided he's gonna launch an attack on Chengdu. Chengdu has a very low troop count, but um, 
and it's, those are good pikes, but there's 5,000 of them. And uh, on their way to Chengdu, they're going to meet up with these guys. <laughs> so yeah, I don't think that's going to go very well for you, buddy. But whatever. All right, let's uh, let's head on up to uh, Zhuge Liang's stomping grounds here. See if there's anything that Zhuge Liang can take care of while he's here, because otherwise, otherwise I'm going to move him to a more a city where he's more useful. soldiers, so they too need to start really outfitting a lot. These guys are going to bow and arrow? Yeah. Alright, well. Got a bit more of that than I do of some other stuff that I need, though. Alright, now Cao Cao has retaken Wan, which begs the question, are they going to start trying to attack me again? Are they going to be content with where they are? And what happened to Liu Kong's navy? Liu Kong's navy is now taking the fight to Cao Cao. These guys, they're just... Tsai Yi, he just really wants to fight. His name is Tsai Yi, and he loves to fight. He's fighting Zhu Huang, who could probably kick his ass on land, but kind of sucks in a boat, so... He's in a boat, motherfuckers, he's in a boat. Not eyes unit has been destroyed, by the way. I think he may show up in uh Oh, but you get June, I forgot you were even out there. I'm sorry, man. And you couldn't predict get Ying Bu, but that's okay. See, I think Meng Meng Da might be in um Armad. I've completely lost it. Ma Chao's cousin, brother, whatever. The guy's unit just got destroyed. I think he shows up in Dynasty Warrior 7. Or will show up in Dynasty Warrior 7, but... I'm not really sure what I'm saying anymore, so forget it. You know, if I'd known they were going to have to take that freaking path, I would have had them go to Chengdu. I mean, why did I send those guys, Mr. Sirius' guys, all over? Ugh. Grimoth is probably kind of like snickering right now. Why did I send all that equipment all the way to Jiang Zhuo when there's no direct path and they were going to have to curve all the way around? 
where the hell did this uh, unit of Liu Zhangs end up? They're still curving around the corner here. Okay. Alright. Just surrender Liu Zhang. Sleeping, whatever dragon. Okay. So yeah, same same basic scenario every turn here. I'm just um. necessary to take that port back, but it still seems kind of silly. Alright, you guys. It looks like you're not going to be able to get to Chengdu without running into my army. That's good. That's very good. I keep thinking I want to summon Zhu Ge Liang to this city, but why? Really? Other than the fact that there's nobody there running the show. Get into the city. In the city. 
下立命。Nobody would have room to actually get as big as I am. Awesomeness. Alright, so yeah, we're continuing along in much the same as we have been. This game has its uh, exciting patches and its slow patches, and right now, Shi Hao Dune is also known as patches. Right now, it's just the places that I'm attacking are gonna be pretty. Pardon me, folks, lost my headset for a second there. No, the places I'm attacking are kind of geographically difficult to get to, and Tao Tao's got ludicrous amounts of technique points built up. What will be my next move? Well, I want you to get Moth Su hired so you can get your ass back to Zetong. But I would like that to be your next move. Sure, you want us to move to Ling? Ling? <laughs> yes, go back to Young and but I want your kind here. Now, folks, 63,000 troops. What do you say we march? Uh, wow, that's a lot of stuff. Got a ship that I could take? No, no vessels are available. Protect Dong Ting. Become instantly hostile with those guys, which is fine. They had to know. They were coming to take him down. Yue Ying! She has been a pretty damn useful officer, I must say. Soon Wukong, you even got our former lead strategist Zhu Xu working for you. That's not too shabby. Certainly not for a monkey. Wei Yan and Doom screaming together at last, the ultimate team. Now the only real threat is am I leaving them thinly populated enough that Ling Ling is going to attack? Well, Ling Ling's got like no troops. Surprised they've got as few as they do. 
I'm not sure why those guys are so weak down there, but um, they are. And I want to try to march in Super Awesome Bow Unit, might as well. Chang Hong should have a chance to show his might. He got to show off what an action badass he is, and that's important, folks. And meanwhile, the city itself... ...can... I don't know what they can do. They can get lost, as I... Kind of lose focus for a second. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, you've got Liu Bei is still Liu Bei is not personally going to become an action man in this battle. He's going to let his uh, vassals do the heavy lifting. If it's appropriate, he's looking to become emperor, not like field general. Pancakes guy, you did not get a field command in this. I did not realize that was going to happen. Zhang Bao and Sha Mok either. I mean, wow. That's I have concentrated a lot of highfalutin military dudes down there. Pancakes guy, Sha Mok, and Zhang Bao all failed to uh, get in there when I just did auto settings on my units. Anyway. Yeah, I got lots of officers now because I'm taking them from the forces I've conquered. I'm throw some gold around at some of those officers. Yang Song, yeah, you, you you totally deserve this, buddy. Let's get your loyalty from 99 to 100. We don't want to lose you. That's stupid. But anyway, folks, the battle rages on. You guys even close to uh, fighting these guys? All right, they're gonna swing up here. Now, unless they come this way and try to take the plank way, we're in good shape. If they come up this way and try to plank, take the plank way, they could theoretically get to... Oh, he couldn't acquire Hang Zhang. But Zhuge Liang has successfully employed Ma Su. Allow me to assist Liu Bei with my resourcefulness. I will completely screw up the defense at one of the major battles, like in the novel, and get executed. Yay. But Liu Kong doesn't like us that much anymore. Which is, you know, he's the next on my hit list, so... Not counting this guy's in the far south that I'm going to take out. Yeah, I was saying these guys could get to Jiang Zhao, but they're not taking it over. It's got 55,000 troops. But now we're back to things being exciting again, folks. I've got uh, field armies attacking two different areas. That's, uh, that's good, right? Bows over here. <laughs> Dong Ting captured, folks. Yeah, we didn't really get anything out of that so much, but that's fifteen gold there. But it's one more little bit of green on our map. And it should mean that they're hostile with us now, yes. Now everybody's got an opinion. Everybody's either hostile or allied with us. Nobody's in between. And that seems like a might be a good place to end the video. Let me just double check. I'm having a paranoia attack that I'm not even recording right now, but... up here, computer. I just want to check and see if I'm recording real quick. Uh, and I am recording. Excellent. Alright, folks, when we come back, you know what? I'm going to end this video anyway. Uh, sorry, end this recording session. I'm definitely ending the video. I'm going to end this recording session just out of pure paranoia. But when we come back, folks, uh, I am going to continue launching attacks on Liu Zhang and what's his name. And uh, within the next couple of videos, Shu uh, should have grown even huger and more unstoppably cool. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.